Hello and welcome to another event matches tutorial. So today we're going to talk about adding a speaker to your event. But before we can add a speaker to an event, we actually have to add the speaker to the database first. And so in order to do that, you're going to navigate to your left hand menu and underneath presenters, there's the button that says speakers. You're going to want to click on that. And then once you click on that, you can see all of the speakers that you have in the database. And if you are wanting to add a speaker that isn't in this database, you're going to want to click add new speaker. Once you click on that, um, you're going to be brought to this page. And so first you need to select the category for your speaker. So you can either make them a speaker, an honoree, governor, or panelist. We're just going to leave it as speaker. Next, you're going to add the name for your speaker. So in this case, we'll use Jeff Bezos, who's the CEO and founder of Amazon. And then here you can add designation, email, and website. So if the speaker has any of this information that they want you to share, you can do so right here. We're just going to leave this blank. And then for description, you would just add a description of the uh, speaker. So founder and CEO of Amazon and an expert in business. Keep in mind that um, for this description field as well as the name, this will be visible to the user who is um, viewing your landing page and your event page. So just be really descriptive and like flattering to your speaker here and give as much information as you can. Next, you can add in Facebook, Twitter, Google Plus, Pinterest, or LinkedIn profiles. This will link to that person's um, respective profiles on our event page. And so if they want you to share that information, you can do so here. Next, you can add an image for your speaker. So um, you just click choose file, and then you would need to save an image beforehand on your computer, but then you would just select that file. It's automatically going to take you to this cropping screen here, and then um, you can crop the picture how you, you want it to be presented on the page. And then just click confirm whenever you're ready. And then you're going to click save. And so now um, you can see it says data saved successfully. And now the event speaker has been saved to the database. And so you can see that Jeff Bezos is now right here. But just because you've added them to the database does not mean that you've added them to the event. So in order to add them to the event, you first need to click on events. And then you're going to scroll down to the event that you want to add them to. In this case, we'll add them to the Plano, Texas matchmaking event. And then you want to click on event speakers once you get to this dashboard. And now, as you can see, um, Jeff Bezos is back on this menu. And so you're going to just click that little check mark button next to his name. And then, as you can see, we also have Mark Zuckerberg as a speaker and as well as Tim Cook. And so these are going to be the three speakers for our event. Now, if you go back to events, and you go to back to your event that you just added the speakers to and you click on the landing page. And if you go to menu, speakers, you can see that now you have all three speakers here. And so all the speakers have been added. If you click on their name, it gives the description that you gave. And so that is how you add an event speaker to both the back end and the actual event itself.